is uh, one of Travis's most famous songs, The Cannonball Rag. It's been called The Cannonball Rag, The Cannonball Stomp, Cannonball, and uh, just Cannon. Um, it's got a lot of the chords we discussed earlier in it. It starts out, of course, it's in the key of G, and it starts out with an E7th with that, that weird sort of a E7th chord like this. You'll notice on this one, Travis always seemed to alternate the bass, but instead of like Chet doing that little alternating boom tick doom tick, Travis hit those strings and strum it. Doing this. And you get that thumb over there, so it's so you get that E seventh chord and this is all I'm doing with the thumb, just once again, that big, heavy thumb. All one finger, if you, if you must be authentic. It's just an A chord with that, keeping that B on top. Into this ninth that he does, once again. And you're you're bringing you're using your thumb to do the bass lead lines, and the, so you got uh, keeping the same chord and just bringing up the E string with your little finger, lifting it up. That's why you don't want to use that bar chord because you can't lift it up. first part. Now you go to a regular D seventh chord with with an A on the bottom. Travis always grabbed both of those strings with this one finger. So you're going, you're just pulling it. As you bring down your thumb with the afterbeat, you're pulling your this B string to an open E. And Same thing with the G chord. Get that thumb over there and hit both of those strings. Don't forget to hit them. Don't, don't be nice and clean. 